Are you the artist? I am. What is this? Are, were you inspired by Picasso? Yeah, of course. I mean, it completely ripped it off from Picasso, you, you could say as well. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm so, painting with the, with the Fremont Abbey. You know, are you familiar with the Fremont Abbey? I just Abbey? did an interview with the director. Perfect. Great. Yeah, so I paint with them. I paint for the round once in a while, so I'll paint. Um, while musicians play on stage, do a live painting. So kind of the same thing here. People are welcome to contribute to it and add to it, and it evolves over the day. So what is this? Tell me what you see. Well, it's, What was your inspiration? It's a complete rip-off of a Picasso painting was my yeah. inspiration. Yeah, so I mean, I changed the colors, changed location, and morphed a little bit, but... I kind of made my own version of it, I would say. Are you happy with it? Are you going to do anything else with it? Oh, it'll totally change. So, um, his beard has changed several times. Her hair has changed. I haven't really resolved the background yet, but I have until 6 o'clock, so hopefully it'll work out. You got some paint on your eyebrow. Do I? Yeah. All right. Did you do that, or? It's just <laughs> the act of. I think that it just happened. I didn't know it was there. Yeah. So where can people find inf more information about you as an artist? About me, you can uh, check out my blog, Brent Holland is Rad, at blogspot.com. What's it like being an artist? I don't know, it's fun, it's easy. Does it pay? Um, for me, yeah, I teach high school art, so that part of it pays, and then in my summers I'm able to paint as much as I want and do my own studio work. And, uh, I don't need it to pay, but it does, so it's fun. What's your dream job? I'm doing it. Teaching high school art and painting in the summers. You're living your dream. Is this, is this yeah. what you wanted to do when you uh, were a little kid? Oh, definitely not. I didn't realize I was into art until well into college. So this was a secondary thing. It was a surprise to me. For somebody who wants to grow up and be just like you, what's some, what is some advice you would like to give them? Don't be just like me. I don't know. <laughs> um, I don't know. Just paint. Don't worry about rules or what it looks like. Just paint and do whatever you want. Do whatever you want. The freedom to do whatever you want. Yes. That, that sounds yes. Well, maybe free. to be more honest, like, is that what you say in your class? Hey, hey, kids. Yeah, yeah. Just do whatever you want. Come, come on in. You can do it. This is the no, do whatever no. you want class. Yeah, I think. To be more specific, I guess I encourage my kids by having to think of, of painting as not being just a realistic something, so not a painting of a face or a scene or a sunset or the typical cliche, um, you know, person working, painting cliche art. So kind of to, to divert away from that, I introduced them to Picasso and other contemporary artists um, to not paint what is the norm, to not paint realism anymore. Your name again? My name is Brent Holland. And where are we, Brent? We are at the Fremont Solstice Parade in the Fremont Fair. Why are you painting with a pencil in your ear? Because um, I was drawing first. Is this out of a sketch? Yeah, yeah, I did a, I did a quick sketch of it um, this morning, and I sketched it on the board before I started painting, just to give me a little bit of an idea of where I might want to end and how I might want to start it.